What's up guys, Hey King here bringing you a live reaction to, well, the Avengers 4 trailer, like, of, of Avengers Endgame, uh, like, okay, I just woke up, okay, it's like freaking, what's the time? It, it, it's freaking 2.19 in the afternoon, okay, I've just been sleeping and I've decided to wake up and check my phone and what do I see? Avengers, I've the new trailer's out, the final trailer, what? What? Okay, so, yeah, besides scaring the shit out of my key, uh, here I am, waiting to, to watch this, so, uh, no more talking, let's get into it, like, because holy shit, I've been waiting for this. I thought it was going to come out next week, like, holy damn, holy damn. It's popping, uh, let's just do this, like, because I'm lost for words, like, holy shit. Uh, yeah. Two minutes and 28 seconds, hopefully, hopefully we get a lot of action. Here we go. Okay, I Iron Man 1? Is it Iron Man 1? Yeah, it seems like a thousand years ago. <laughs> it does seem like my way out of that cave. Became Iron Man. Oh. Realized I loved you. Oh. oh I meant free. I know I said no more surprises, but I was really hoping to pull off one last one. You will, man. You will. Cap. The world has changed. None of us can go back. Oh. All we can do is our best. Oh. Oh. And he's... sometimes the best that we can do. I thought he was training someone. No. Oh. Is to start over. His family is dead. Oh shit. That's God. I saw all these people die. Should have gone for the I head. Keep telling everybody they should move on. Some do, but not us. Even if there's a small chance, we owe this to everyone who's not in this room to try. What is going on? What is going on? <laughs> it's awesome. What is this? What is this? Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. It's awesome. Where's Captain Marvel? Where's Thanos? I like this one. <laughs> oh, it was another emotional trailer. I'm not satisfied. Oh, my neck. Cramps. Cramps. Oh, shit. I'm not satisfied. I, I want to see more. I want to see more action. <laughs> Jesus, it's funny. I was at work last night and we were just talking. I was talking to one of my friends. And we're like, they don't have to show a new trailer, like, people are gonna see this anyway now. I mean, the hype is so high for this film, and then what do you know, boom, trailer comes out the next day. It's so bloody unexpected and hilarious. I didn't think they would release one, this one so early, like, because... Because the, the anniversary for the last one was, was the 16th of March, wasn't it? And then uh, they, they released the Endgame first trailer teaser a week after they released the Infinity One anniversary, do you know what I mean? Like the year before, so I assume it's, they're gonna do that, but no, this came out earlier, like, hot damn, hot damn, <laughs> like, holy shit. Uh, I need to watch that trailer again, and I wanna pay attention to it this time a bit, because I was kind of talking over some of the lines, but I just, just noticed some of the visuals, maybe, maybe do a breakdown. Um, so let's go for it, uh, let's go for it, let's go for it one more time, guys. Uh, again, I gotta applaud them. They're not spoiling anything. Like uh, it's brilliant. They're not. They're keeping everything. They're keeping everything to their chest. So that's that's really great. Watching this trailer, I can't figure out what the hell is going on, and I think that's gonna be the best feeling in the world going into this movie, not knowing unless there's leaks. And there's, there's always going to be leaks, I think, a, a week or two before the film comes out. 
but uh, so far every leak I have read has just been utter bogus and, and, and not real, okay? So you can tell it's not real. Compared to when Infinity War was coming out, they pretty much guessed who the three main characters were that were going to permanently die. And then, like, how everyone was going to die at the very end as well, because, like, the stat was going to happen. So th those were the spoilers that kind of got leaked beforehand. But it was done in such a weird way, like, oh, this character's going to die at the end, but then they die in the beginning instead. But, like, it got everything else right. So it it's weird, like, when you, get, when you read spoilers like that. Loki! Stop eating my... Stop eating Mousy! Stop it! Ah, you shit. It was you, wasn't it? He's, he's messing with my toy. Loki! Oh yeah, the second guy. <laughs> Loki? <sighs> you little shit. Ah. <sighs> What's up, guys? Yeah, this is Loki, by the way. That, that's his name, if you didn't know before. Mwah, you look cute. Mm. Let's watch this trailer again. One, two, three, go! God, it seems like a thousand years ago. I fought my way out of that cave. Became Iron Man. Realized I loved you. This is kind of what I wanted. I wanted them to show the different movies, and then no more surprises. But so, so it's cool I they did really that. Really hoping to pull off one last one. The world has changed. None of us can go back. All we can do is our best. That's and depressing. They found the best that, we can do. Start over. I'm surprised they don't show Loki instead, but I saw all these people die. I keep telling everybody they should move on. Some do, but not us. Not us. Even if there's a small chance, we owe this to everyone who's not in this room to try. I wonder, if that's a soft read, right? Like, it Maybe. feels like it's Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. What is going on here? Whatever it takes. Oh, I'm sorry, you wanna get up? Go on. Go on. I like this one. <laughs> and that's that's that. Uh, oh, I can't wait. Don't scratch the carpet, guy. Come on, Loki. Don't go into the garbage. Ah, oh, no, leave the tripod alone. <laughs> cute. Um. Yeah, I, I can't figure out what's going on there. I really, I really can't. All, all I can tell really is is that we will get probably some sort of early fight scene. They're gonna lose, and then uh, they're gonna have to come up with the whole quantum realm theory. I think because we know from the shareholders meeting that Captain Marvel comes, and then they decide to go into space. At which point, I assume they're all gonna flop and lose anyway. Clint's clearly got his own mission. He's doing something. Don't know what that involves. <laughs> And then eventually it's all gonna culminate to them meeting up, discussing what to do. Tony's probably gonna. I don't see Tony in there. That's the interesting thing. I don't think I saw Tony in that trailer at uh, all in the Iron Man suit. Um, which makes me think he's probably with Scott Lang. And they're the, they're the two going through time, perhaps. 
Which is a bit weird when you consider the set photos we saw with Cap as well, but that was Cap 1, so I don't know what's going on there. Maybe they go through time and they get Cap from Avengers 1 and they convince him to help them. So them three decide, so we get two different versions of Cap. The one from uh, from Avengers 1, before all of the crap happened, and then the one from, from Endgame. And then, I don't know, like, maybe that, that's what the, that's, maybe that's what happens, actually, because he's got one of the devices on, but he's wearing a different suit. So, I don't know, it's, it's a bit weird, it's a bit weird. Uh, I'm just trying to come up with theories here. So, them three, they go through time, and they try to sort out what they're trying to sort out. Uh, they go through the quantum realm, and then at the end, maybe once them three have gone through and they've discovered some shit, they come back, and then they tell everyone else after their first fight with Thanos, and all of them, they flop, they tell them what's happened. And that's when they decide to go with this plan and they join forces and they go for the quantum realm. Now, apparently this footage is meant to be from the first 50 minutes. I don't think so. I don't think for one second that's from the first 50 minutes. That looks stuff that... I feel like we've just seen stuff that's going to happen in the first two acts. And the whole with them wearing the white suits and that is going to be from the third act. So I think whatever happens in the third act with them wearing... That's going to happen at the very end of the movie. Like, And if this film is three hours long, I assume an hour for each act. That's how they're going to break it down. So the first hour is them is them gonna you know the characters meeting up, they're gonna go into space, they're gonna flop. Uh, act two is them coming back and just being bloody bloody depressed and shit. And maybe we're gonna get a time skip of sorts because Natasha's got red hair on that. She's already got the ponytail, but she doesn't have the red hair. And Cap is supposed to have his beard apparently when he meets with uh, when Captain Marvel first appears. So I don't know. A lot of shit is a lot of shit's going on. So a lot of weird shit. So I'm thinking they are gonna lose that first fight. Come back. Emotional breakdown. Tony's gonna sort himself out. He's gonna meet Scott Lang's gonna come in. That's when the whole quantum world idea comes through. They're gonna go on their little adventure if they haven't already, and they're gonna come back uh, and they're gonna explain what they have to do. And then boom, third act, they go for the quantum realm and they 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 hit Pacific points. Thanos comes in, big fight, boom, snap is reversed. We get that big scene. Yeah, we get the big scene with all the characters. Sorry, my camera stopped there for a second. But yeah, uh, very long video. I'm trying to think of ideas here. But anyway, guys, I hope you like my reactions today. It's always like and subscribe wherever and actually. I shall see you and I shall see you. Take care and bye.